talking to the director of the Tennessee State University Marching Band, uh, Mr. Edward Graves. And of course, uh, uh, Prof, uh, the last uh, six minutes that we have here, let's give you an opportunity to talk about some of the things that you feel that uh, our audience ought to know this morning about what you are trying to accomplish, uh, some of your goals, your objectives, and some of the things that you try to do with your students. Those are uh, uh, quite a number of things to try to talk about in six minutes, but within that framework, you know, to kind of freely give us uh, that kind of information. Okay. Well, well, first of all, I'd like to acknowledge the people that are working with us uh, now. we on our staff. Uh, we're very fortunate to have a very outstanding staff of dedicated educators. Uh, right now we have Mr. Kevin Davenport, who's our Associate Director of Bands, a 1984 Tennessee State University graduate. Uh, has had some very uh, good success uh, in public schools before we were able to get him to come here. Uh, Mr. Thomas Davis, who's been with us uh, at Tennessee State for about 22 years, I believe. Uh, who works with our band and teaches percussion at the university. Mm -hmm. uh, Mr. James Sexton, who's a uh, Tennessee State graduate also that's on our staff that does primarily mm -hmm. responsible for arranging for the band, a very fine uh, arranger right. mm -hmm. and dedicated uh, uh, musician. Uh, we have Mr. Charles Dungey, who's mm -hmm. working with our jazz program. Mm -hmm. uh, Mrs. Judy Gentry that does a majorette. And uh, we have Michelle Allen, who's a recent Tennessee State graduate that serves as our secretary. Mm -hmm. uh, what we try to do with, is much more involved in band than what the people see. Good. Uh, this is an activity that we see these students have decided themselves this is something they want to do. Mm -hmm. And we've been able to, very fortunate to get a, a very group of very talented students, 30% of which are honor roll students at Tennessee State University and they achieve this during the busiest time of the year. So we try to use this as a character building activity for them because of the fact this is something they chose to do and this is not what they really came to Tennessee State for. Mm -hmm. uh, they have to understand that they have to take the same values that they take from that practice field in the band rehearsal room mm -hmm. to the history class mm -hmm. and some of them in your classes, mm -hmm. uh, the math classes and everything that they came here to do. Uh, we have a number of students that are engineers. We have students in the band program that are in every academic mm -hmm. discipline mm -hmm. over there. Mm -hmm. And they do well. Uh, we're fortunate, as I said, to get students from uh, a lot of different areas of the country. Mm -hmm. uh, and it's a problem for us because of the fact that whatever amount of money we have for scholarships, you don't aid, have enough. It's not enough. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, so we don't have full scholarships. Our, our average scholarship for a student is $1,000 a semester. Mm -hmm. And uh, we are constantly looking and begging and mm -hmm. pleading for people to please help us mm -hmm. to be able to bring